So if you could just tell us your name. Uh, Lieutenant Colonel Gary Ingen. Lieutenant Colonel Terry Pitts. And could you tell us a little bit about your organization, what it is and, and how it started? We're a chapter of the uh, Military Order of the World Wars, which is a national veterans organization. Uh, there are about uh, 90 chapters throughout the nation, and we're one here in Augusta. There's a couple other in the state of Georgia. Uh, we've been around since the uh, 1980 time frame uh, in the Augusta chapter. The organization has been around since 1919 in various places. Wow. So it goes back to World War One. That's right. It was established by General John Blackjack Pershing after uh, World War One in 1919. Came back to the states and wanted an opportunity for his officers to serve their country in some other ways besides what they just went through in the war. So he established this organization and it's been ongoing ever since. What does the organization do? Can you say some things about that. The organization exists. The organization exists to reach out to people to talk about service, our country, patriotism. There are many organizations that, and I'm a member of some, that exist to further their own membership. I, I fly, for example, I'm in a pilot's group. We look out for rules for pilots. The military order does not focus on privileges or benefits for its own members, but for society as a whole, the lessons that people should know about patriotism and leadership and being a good citizen. Tell me about this. Oh, go ahead, Gary. And there, and there are several tenets to uh, what our organization does. This here is a part of our support for the youth and to educate the youth in the, in the various uh, uh, things that we'd, we'd like for them to understand and, and know and, and be better citizens. And then, then there's the outreach to uh, uh, the Boy Scouts and to the ROTC, both the senior and the high school level, recognize those that uh, have achieved higher levels in, in those areas. Uh, and we sponsor a lot of veterans' activities marches, ceremonies, Veterans Day, Memorial Day, those kinds of things, patriotism, encourage flying fly the flag and uh, being a, a patriotic American. So this is a youth leadership group. Tell us about that and what, what is the point of this weekend? Well, it's, it's to get across uh, primarily four different subjects that we want to make sure we do cover during the couple days that we have here. It's, uh, one is, of course, leadership. That's the title. Uh, uh, give them the tenets of, of becoming a better leader. Another uh, is uh, in the economics area, free enterprise. Uh, they give them one of high school students to understand what the importance is of free enterprise. Another is uh, the, uh, the U.S. Constitution and government. And uh, the other is values and ethics uh, uh, better them and the knowledge of that. The high schoolers who are here this evening and tomorrow were selected for their leadership abilities, who they are in school and what their teachers and guidance counselors think of them. So this is a subset of the leadership of the early future, and it's a chance not to lecture at them, but to let them talk among each other with a little bit of coaching and some guided questions to talk about some pretty complicated topics, and they do it well. Good. Thank you so much.